Listen, Rose, you're going to go on and make lots of babies, and you're going to watch them grow. Promise me you'll survive. Never thank you, Mr. Rivera Perez, for writing a play as brave as Pinata Man, a lowly Pinata maker who pretends to be as empty as the toys he makes. Uh, who's next? You have my headshot, correct? Uh, yes. Oh, excellent. Then Duper said we were out of paper clips, so I went to the supply closet, and guess what your old dad found behind the post-it? <gasps> Had my big audition, and it's the role of a lifetime. Much bigger than my voiceover work on Pac-Man the Animated Series. I eat ghosts like you for breakfast! I'm smarter than you, I'm stronger than you, I can wet nurse better than you. Easy, girls. Sorry, Stan. Anything you can do, I can do better. I can do anything better than you. Can't we have one meal without you two getting into an angry singing contest? Why is everything a competition? Yeah, you guys should just and get it over with. Roger, while you act in your little community theater plays, do you know where I am? Jerking it? I'm on undercover CIA missions, acting for an audience of ruthless thugs, terrorists, and assassins. You're a badass, Dad. You guys don't really do that James Bond stuff. And you! That's enough from you for the night. It's bedtime. Go to your room. So, what's on the agenda for tonight's sleepover? Well, after pizza, we'll retire to my treehouse, watch an 80s crab fest, say Critters or Critters 2. <laughs> Delicious! <laughs> oh, wait, wait. You dorks still have slumber parties. <laughs> <laughs> have you ever seen the word piñata, Miss Lopez? It has that squiggly line over the end that looks like an eyebrow. Or a stain upon the soul. So lying. You know, Stanislavski says that acting is the grandest lie. Oh! My mom's picking us up in front any minute. Yeah, uh, I just remembered. I gotta go get my circumcision touched up. And Toshi and I have to get to a taping of... We're not kids anymore. There's a person inside Big Bird. But the best moments of our lives have been at sleepovers, remember? Come. I know we gotta grow up sometime, but damn it, not today! I say we plan one last sleepover, two weeks from today. The sleepover to end all sleepovers! Hurry up, people. The Indonesian drug cartel will be here any minute. It's almost showtime. Smith, you need to get into wardrobe and makeup. Good evening, gentlemen. Right this way. That's your cue. You're offering me water, but somehow I'm not buying that you are really offering me water. It's a setup! <laughs> Don't blame yourself. Oh, thank you. That's acting. How cool is this? He got shot in the back of the head, now he's just like a puppet. Hope he doesn't mind I'm doing this. Tur? What? Tur? What are you doing, Roger? What 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 am I what am I doing, Stan? What? Tur? Well, whatever he's doing, it doesn't sound genuine. God, it was terrible. Hilarious. Big piece for the guy who didn't create 14 widows last night. I had a great teacher. You should look him up. Tell him I sent you. Erwin Byer Jr., acting coach. This, this is you, isn't it? I'm, I'm gonna get down there and it's gonna be you. And he said, I don't. After each take, I simply ask them, how did that feel? Oh. Some no. Some. Log that emotion, save it for a rape scene. Okay, we still have this week. Let's get to work. Peter and Bess, you'll be doing a scene from Hamlet. Jamie and Daryl, you'll do Our Town. Broderick and Sheedy are trying to flee Goose Island to prevent global thermonuclear war. But David's about to face his own personal war. I can't, okay, Wonder Woman? I can't swim. I always thought there was going to be plenty of time. I wish I didn't know about any of this, and tomorrow it would just be over. Okay, Stan, we're going to run this scene all week until you make it perfect. The rest of you will get no attention from me, but there's no refunds, so... Where for our last sleepover? Nah, I don't know. The striped ones are better for hiding unwanted pillow fight boners. No, no kimonos. Just this morning, there were four other boys looking at these same very jammies. They <laughs> smacked of rich. 
Come on, this guy's full of it. And you better hurry up, because little Vince is throwing a sleepover, and Bindi Irwin is coming. Yeah. <laughs> oh, ma'am. Yeah! To learn how to swim. <laughs> that was a fake fart, because I couldn't summon up a real one to express my disgust with your acting. And you have one. Just like David doesn't know how to swim, you don't know how to act. Stacy, I want to try something with Stan. Go get me a bite. I want you to exchange the word swim with the word act. Maybe we can swim for it. No. I always thought there was going to be plenty of time. Wish I didn't know about any of this and tomorrow it would just be over. Oh, God. I really wanted to learn. Such confusing progress. Okay, let's finish the scene. Wait, we can't finish the scene. They kiss. So? I'm not going to kiss you. Wrong, wrong, wrong. Pudding man! Okay, so we're all agreed. We're going to go with the pepperoni. Oh, I don't know. Pepperoni doesn't seem like a last sleepover pizza. You know, because... Don't bite my head off! Yeah, don't bite his head off! Shut up, Barry! You're just gonna eat all the pizza anyway! Hey, don't lob factual statements at me as if they're in this crap! <gasps> Learn English! Learn English! Stop! All of you, just stop! You know what? I don't think we've outgrown sleepovers. I think we've outgrown each other. Attention, I have the cast list. Now, when they announce me as the lead, I want you to pop this bottle of champagne and pound it so you can work up the courage to go by me. Yata man. Stan Smith! <gasps> what? Inside us are the same, no? Love is no? Salty, salty with tears. Would the senor and senorita like to hear coming to see me? I'm crushing hard on one of them. Do you know what that's like, Mr. Rivera Perez? You're a gay amateur director. You must have crushed hard on someone along the way. Yep. Don't need anyone else to have a good time. Just, uh... Hi, what, what are you doing here? We got an email that the sleepover was back on. I didn't send any email. I did. How did you... Let's just say someone sent me an email about what went down. I understand you guys got in a big fight. Look, you aren't mad at each other. But first, I suggest you all turn around so you can see Steve's mom undressing through that window. Mmm, look at them tig old bitty. And her understudy were both injured in a freak accident. Well, how are we gonna do the show without a leading lady? Luckily, I met an ingenue today who knows the play by heart. Really? Seems like something I would totally do. Get ready, Stan. I'm gonna act circles around you out there. We'll see. May the best actor win. Yes. Are you the piñata man? <laughs> <laughs> Why did I give my heart to a man who breaks everything he makes? Cause I'll be breaking and making and taking your heart. You've been shaking and faking and snaking from the start. Flag steak! Ricky Lake! Flag steak! Out! <laughs> Listen to that. Play will go off the rails, and once and for all, it will be clear that I'm the better actor. The same, no? Lo mismo. Salty. Salty with tears. You call that acting? This is acting. <laughs> Public indecency? We weren't really doing it, we were just acting! You know why they thought we were having sex? Amazing energy! Uh, I don't get it. They're friends again? Told ya. They just needed to f We never figured out which one of us emailed Ronnie. In fact, to this day, I'm pretty sure he was just some black dude who overheard us planning our sleepover in the pizza parlor.